I bet some of you Mercedes diesel enthusiasts recognize what I'm holding here. It, it, for those of you not familiar with these older Mercedes diesels, this will look kind of weird because it does, it does actually look kind of weird. This is the timing device that's installed in the forward section of these older Mercedes diesels and the timing device drives on one end, it drives the fuel injection pump and on the front end it drives the vacuum pump. The purpose of this center section, that's why it's called a timing device, is as the engine speeds up and slows down, it changes the injection pump timing, delivery timing. So that's, that's why it's called a timing device. And what I've, uh, this, I mean, over the years, have I ever had to replace one of these? Have any of you ever had to replace one of these? No, these are very robust, very reliable. I've, I, I haven't even seen one disintegrate. I've heard a couple stories, but there are some problems cropping up with these as these engines continue to age and they are continuing to get older and older and older. So what I'm doing is I'm currently working on a complete video series on the Mercedes diesel fuel injection system, going through various stages of it and doing video manuals, explaining and, and, and explaining how the, the theory of operation, how to troubleshoot for problems, what the common problems are, and of course, how to fix them. And I, I've just recently finished a video, an instructional video that talks all about this timing device and the problems I'm seeing and how you can spot problems and then what you're going to have to do to fix them. So if you're interested in learning more about the timing device, be sure and check it out. Check out my video instruction on demand manual on my website. Uh, just follow the link below and it'll take you right to it. And you might be amazed at, at some of the things that this does and some of the problems that are starting to show up with it.